Well, 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 well. Welcome to The Madness That Returns. Here in Alice, Madness Returns. I'm your host, Clara Fox, also known as Travis. And we are continuing onwards to be with our precious little princess, Alice. Who's got some swagginess behind her. Oh boy, let's see what the Mad Hatter's up to. Because it looks like we got to protect him. This feels like an earthquake. What's happening? Do I really look like I know? Your judgment must be severely impaired. <laughs> Mad Hatter doesn't really care. He's just like, okay, it's an earthquake, but I gotta get this working. Uh, you do your thing, I do my thing. Alright, totally do that. Listen to him grumble. Listen to him grumble about down there. <laughs> well, at least he's got his limbs back. So now he's basically like a superhuman. He kind of reminds me kind of a, uh, of a, um, like a scarecrow mixed with a uh, Mad Hatter from Batman right now. Because how tall he is and everything. Okay, that opened up another little portal, but we got these boxes. Give me some teeth, baby. Yeah, get some teeth. We got 1,100. I'm gonna, I'm just gonna wait it out. Cause I think I'm gonna really just upgrade. Not right now, just yet. It's basically. Let's take a look real quick on that. Weapons. We're gonna need 675 and 475. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna upgrade. Yep, we're gonna upgrade this right now. That's gonna be 800 next. But all we gotta do is just get a few more for the uh, the pepper gun, and then we'll upgrade the pepper gun to level two. Because the primary weapon we got is the knifeu that ends the lifeu. Double checking everything first. Looks like we got the fall down there anyway, but I'm just gonna come over here real quick. Oh, can't go up there. Oh well. Coming down here. Bunch of rubble. Will this work? Mmm, doesn't work. Did I just trap myself? Nope, I sure did. Right here. Blow it! There we go! Wanna see a magic trick? I left the fussy cuss at home. And he's like, uh huh. Uh huh. I'm trying to open this door from over here. You could have told me you were going there. I don't think he's too happy right now. Don't worry, Hatter. Just keep your hat on, man. We got this. Dang! He judo kicked that thing open. Before we go there, is there anything over here? Nope. Oh boy, all the music stops. So that means either cutscene. Yep, cutscene. Is it just me or is that train glitching into things? I thought I saw like a steel pipe or something in the middle of it. It just goes straight through it. We found the source of the shaking, but are those two quaking? What are they up to? You'll never stop us, silly Hatter and Alice. It's left. You're too the late. The insolence, the arrogance, the execrable table manners. They are destroyers of Wonderland, defilers, denuders, derangers, delightful. Is Did they actually create that infernal train to destroy Wonderland? What does that matter? They deserve to die. Put me down this instant! I am enough talk. Battle time, Missy. Oh, great battle time! What do we got here? Super giant death robot. Abandon false hope. Forget the past. The damage is done. <laughs> Let the madness begin. Resume the folly. I called it. Super giant death robot! Rock a sock him, baby! Oh, oh no! Ah, oh. 
And apparently they're stupid. Wow, their big plan didn't actually work. First of all, I'm gonna say that I love the storybook like look to it when it does when it does those type of cutscenes. But I'm sorry, the Mad Hatter's so crazy, man. He's like, you tried to kill me. It's okay. I just want another tea party. Let's have another tea party. Ah, I'm not worried about you no more, Alice. I just want to have tea. And then he's going to die, and then Alice is going to drown in tea. Whoop de do. Caught me very own river name. Saints be praised that he works in mysterious ways. He's got plans for her. Take her over to the oh, Mangle Mermaid. Rent a bed. <laughs> Answer woo a girl, Mr. Brawl. Do you think you're doing? What comes natural, like? Not natural to me. Get away. I knew it. I knew it. So everything that's happening in Wonderland's actually technically happening in life. So how many people did she murder? It's got to be that she's been murdering people. The white cat reminds me of my snowdrop. Nanny knew her. Oh my gosh, I forgot because this thing transitions between life and uh Who's and the dream. Tonight, eh, Jake? Yeah, we don't want to be out in this muck. Famous as drop. We got two doing this morning. Hey, what's that? No idea what those crates contain. It's the stuff of dreams. As close as I'm likely to come to be come to exotic places. Well, this box right here clearly says oysters. So I'm sure it's oysters. In here, I have no idea. It's gotta be frozen food. Ice can reflect an image, like amber. Trap preservatives forever or until it melts. Oh, this is a giant blocks of ice. That's true, because back in the old days, you didn't have like ice box or anything, so you actually ordered like ices. You actually ordered like giant ice to keep your stuff cool. Kinda looks like there's something in that block iced over there. Oh well. Man, the city is... The place is completely desolate right now. The Mangled Mermaid. I wonder who is here. Not like my nanny's gonna be here and try to do things. Canterville of... Warless Man. The Asian lousy is a spectacle exhibited to fire eaters and freaks. This is play, uh, play likely bloodthirsty, flamboyant, meteoratic, uh, saucy songs. The audience will be ready to crowd performers. Okay. Very really interesting. Can we get in through here? Tart with some rough edges. Likes everything rough, I'll wager. A handsome offer, but I've got an appointment with another man. Well, girl, how hard do you want to make this? You should know that doctor says I have a terrible disease. Oh, they try to make her to a prostitute. I forgot about that. Men here are kind of like. Where's me money, you fucking spunk bucket? Get those fat ass whores out on the street, or I'll come up and brain you. Shut off, you cocker snipe. 
You'll never get past What the heck's wrong with her eyes? What you and your floozies owe me, Miss Ladybird. See if I don't. Maybe you notice I'm not pissing me drawers at the prospect. Alice Little, you'll make a nice change. Bring your disheveled self up here. Oh, hi, Nanny. Okay. That guy's either really, really sick or he's really, really drunk. I think he's drunk. Let's double check that. That was her tip saying he was likely to die from social disease. Poor man never dreamed its name was Jack Splatter. He looks dead. I'm just gonna say he's drunk. And this is the reason why I don't drink alcohol. Quite a lively place. The women, though, are completely disgusting looking in here. Alright, barroom fight. Quite interesting. For a second, I couldn't go up the stairs there for a second, but okay, we're up now. You won't give me what I want, I'll burn this dump of yours down to the ground. Go away! She's done no harm. <laughs> she hurt me feelings. <laughs> she hurt me feelings. Act like a snuff candle. Sleep, sleep, sleep. Dang, Alice the Fire cut just somehow works together, man. In one way or another, it just works. I want to try to get as, as far as I can in this game for a little while before I probably get started and doing some more live streaming. Um, actually, I think for a live stream series that we're going to be doing, if anyone's interested, if you're watching this video, will most likely be Shadows of the Damned. A Suda 51 game, I believe, from uh, Grasshopper Manufacturer. I've never finished it, but it seemed really funny. And Alice just landed into a new world. My people need me! I love the hair, how I, I love the hair effects in this. Right there, though, it makes it look like the grunge chick. I don't like that. Alright, give me. Ah! We have enough now. Weapon upgrade. Not exactly sure what it upgrades, to be honest. Like, does that make it better in the sense of shooting? Let's see. Hmm, doesn't seem like it's longer or anything. So, hopefully... So, hopefully it's just, like, damage-wise. Something just melted there. Got a lot of stars. Oh! Kill that. Eh... Got two of the three. That's pretty good, my book. Yep. I can go get the third one now. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, I guess you're not supposed to be there because that's a slide. Okay, maybe we gotta go around and go at the top then. I was just trying to collect the freaking teeth, that's all, man. So now we're basically. In a world of ice. Oh, I thought I had to attack them, but nope, I gotta attack these guys. Dodge, 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 dodge. Ow, okay, okay, wrong button, wrong button. That's my fault. Dodge, 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 dodge. All right, get rid of the little guys first. Well, if you want to attack your little youngins, I mean, that's pretty good. That's okay with me. That's okay with my book. You can attack your little youngins. All right, broke your arms. 
You gonna charge it at me, right? Nope. You gonna throw me again into this? Throw me another ball! Throw me another ball! Home run! And three strikes, you're out! Why you running into me, buddy? Come on. Come on. I thought I blocked that one. There we go. Alright. We got a little bit of health back. Everything goes good. And for some reason, a Yeti starts... Taking a lot of breaths. Pixel sets. And that owl is dead. Something about a horse emblem here. Something about the horse emblem. I forgot. I think that's like another weapon we can get. I have no idea why it's breathing that hard. Oh, we didn't even have to jump. We could have just walked there. So why would a Yeti out of the clear blue sky, go through a thing and just start breathing like that. Instead of just being an obstacle. It's gotta have another purpose for that. Let me feed it some spice. Make it all nice. There we go. I was gonna try to open up at sciences, but it didn't work that well. Oh boy. Oh, it's a slide. I thought for a second it was water. Yeah, that's another weapon, isn't it? I have no idea what weapon that does, though. It's one of those horses that you put between your legs and you ride. Hobby horse. Destroy all obstacles with a bridle power. Stamper through the opposition. A smashing hit! Oh, great. So, the Hobby Horse smashes through weak surface walls with ease. It can also break through enemy defenses. So, basically, it's a giant hammer. And that's an ice snark. Not a shark, a snark. An ice snark. And that ice snark just died. How am I not dead? How am I not dead? That... The icicles just fell straight from the sky and landed on top of my head and I'm alive. How am I not dead? I should be totally dead from that. Just saying. Should be totally dead. And apparently we can... Yep! She wields it like a true master! up there. Oh, it's another memory. Definitely want that memory. I'm gonna try to collect them. I'm gonna try to collect as many of the memories as possible. I don't believe I'm gonna collect every single one of them. I think that would be a little bit too much out of my grasp, but there's gotta be. Well, there's a crack up there, so if I can't jump to it, maybe we can uh, fall to it. Nope. Hmm. Let me try one more time. Nope. Okay, so I think we gotta fall to it because there is looks like like there does look to be a, like a crack at the top of the ceiling. So maybe we get a little bit higher up and find a way around. And that's a duck that's just been ripped apart. Okay, Peter's gonna call sooner or later. I think they want their duck back. Here we go, fishy!
I'm gonna have tuna tonight, baby! That's a lot of tuna! Alright, then we're gonna see if we can't find a way to get back to get that memory. If we can't get the memory, we can't get it, but... I'd like to at least try, you know? Still kind of freaked out about all these dead birds and ducks and owls that you see their complete guts. That's one ugly fish. Looks like a big piranha fish, too. Okay. It's a horse icon right here. I'm not gonna jump there just yet. Let's see over here. Oh, that's a bottle. Alright. Well, we're forced to go here, so... I don't think they would make me go so far to just to go, just to get that one memory. Really don't think they would make me go like completely out of my way and then be like, oh, you have to come all the way back here again. All right, this is a slide. All right, slide has two routes. It looks like. And I think that fiery part right there would kill me. Or at least hurt me really, really badly. Uh oh. Can we salvage this? Whoa! Those pro skills right there, man. Those pro skills. Oh, we got this. Where's this leading me to anyway? Yo, them pro skills, man. Giant bottles. So what exactly? I, you know, like I was saying before, like if this is all like in her mind right now, and these are like people and stuff like this, what exactly is she murdering right now? Ouch. Let's get rid of this guy first. Alright, that guy's out. The guy's out of the picture. I just took care of your boy. I took care of your boy. Oh, how's that feel? Let's go dash at me. I got the blocks for days, boy! And you be dead! I'll be damned if you're gonna stop me today, boy! I'm Alice. In Wonderland. Mm-hmm. I say, I say, I say again, I'm Alice in Wonderland, baby. That's a cock shell. Can I hear the ocean from here? I wonder if I can hear the ocean from here. Oh, gold tooth. And... A bottle! Yeah, it looks like we might have lost that memory now. Nowhere else to go, huh? Oh, wait. Nope, there's somewhere to go here. Not going there just yet. Let's go see what this is in the conch shell. What does the conch shell hold for us today, boys and girls? Ah, there you are, Alice. Hello, How kitty. is the queen of hearts like a typhoon? Okay. I gotta say X for that one. Are you pretending to be dense? What is yours, but others use it more than you do? Your name? Excellent. 
What exactly is this? Oh, you can get more health this way. Oh. Well, how the heck was that supposed to? I mean, they're both undiscriminate. I mean, how's the queen like the like a typhoon? I mean, come on. Basically, they destroy everything in their path. That's what I would think. And it's closed up now, so we can't go back. Oh, okay, that's beautiful. Well, at least we got one thing of paint, so I guess I could have gotten two maybe out of that. The ship in a bottle. I mean, stupid cat's asking me questions. I mean, look, I, I have a concussion or something. Like, I, I my memory's not all there, so how am I supposed to remember all this? Stupid cat. Anything oh, yeah, pick snout. So, always good to check your corners, man. Pepper that snout. Booyah! Woo, look at that. Get out to this. I swear, if this brings me back to that first memory. Oh, it's another memory. So I says to the I says, model making's awful and good, but a waste of a perfectly good bottle. I could fill it with gin for thruppets. Okay, the old lady can fill a bottle with gin for thruppets. Good to know, old lady. Good to know. Pretty much you're drunk too. Everybody in this game seems like in the uh, real world seems like they're almost drunk. Heck, I think the guy who probably created this. No offense. Mary McGee created a good game. I just fell right there. Wow. Probably even American McGee who created this is either like on drugs, no offense, or he was really, really intoxicated when he created some of these designs. There we go. That's a better jump. Had to get some speed on that one. Oh, look, an invisible path. An invisible path. Where does the invisible path lead me? To a bunch of teeth! And probably a slide. And a giant shark thing that would just try to gulp me there. Okay. This completely seems completely safe. I mean, the picture says there's teeth behind this wall, so... Hey, let's trust it. Let's trust going behind here. And there's a bottle. And there's a snort. And it's right above my head. So what did you do? Uh-huh. Yeah, I don't trust Mr. Uh, Pirate Shark here. Made out of bones. I'm out. Alice out. Alice say goodbye. And it looks like it's a little bit closer to our destination. What's that over there? There's a bunch of lights in the distance over there. All right, let's get to that ship, boys and girls. Whoa, 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 whoa. No one said the ice was going to fall underneath my feet. I'm out. It's a wooden shark. Board, Alice. We're doomed, of course. What? There's no hope, then? Oh, there's an infinite amount of hope, but none for us. Now get up here. That's a cow. Lunch. 
Down the waterfall we go! Where we land, nobody knows! It's a nice look of ship! Avoid shipwreck sharks, fire cannons, and mines. Fire cannons with the X button and triangle f uh, to fire death charge. Why would it be so far apart then? Oh, this is a side scroller. Oh boy. Oh boy, last time I played a side scroller was Darius Twins. Oh boy, oh, like this. A shoot him upper. Oh no, sharkies! Ah, run for the sharks! Ah, watch yourself, watch yourself, boys and girls, watch yourself! Um, there's a lot of sharks in the water right here for some reason. Explosions! Michael Bay would be proud right about now. The saying. Now we got crabs that are trying to shoot me. Oh, great. Oh, great. I just hit a mine. Ow, just hit a shark. I hit everything. Why is there so many things trying to kill me? What did this cow do? Is he just really tasty? Is Burger King finally decided they want cows underwater now? What's going on? Did he escape from Burger King and now Burger King's just like the king is just like upset. He's bringing in people. That's the only thing I can think of. Woo! Okay. Maybe it's actually Jack in the Box. Ouch. Really? Oh, you, I, I, I mean, if the if the crabs want to kill everything behind me, I have no problem with that. You weren't even shooting at me, but I don't care. I like crab legs. The ship looks like it had a better days so far. Be alert, listen up for picks now. Heed the cat, he offers hints for those in need. And I think we just got shipwrecked. Hello, Ty hello, the we are back with the Titanic. The Titanic. I call it Titanic. It's a Titanic. Oh boy. <laughs> it's okay, Mr. Mukau. My body aches all over. And another <laughs> clothing change. My ship's a wreck, and I am too. Admirals go down with their ships. In any case, I never knew you for a sailor. If memory serves, you were station master of the Looking Glass Line. Mm -hmm. Sacked from the railroad, without the option, redundant, the nitwits said. Never a holiday. Loyal as a bulldog, going in a different direction, my Aunt Fanny, if I had one. Going off the rails more like bloody disaster. Now I'm shipless. The old railroad's dead. And this nitwit's a monstrosity. He never runs on time. Engineers are asleep at the switch. What I don't know about is can't hurt me. Say no more. Not as good as a wink. Change the subject. We avoid speaking about the thing whose name should not be spoken. Hearing something useful about this new train would make for a change? You don't respect the suffering of others. Go ask your questions and smart remarks to Caterpillar. I'm sorry, Admiral. Really. Please, tell me what you know about the train. I'll just say we've escaped a contaminating corruption. Count yourself lucky to be down here. But I don't want to escape. I want to stop it. I must stop it to save myself. And Wonderland too. Nonsense. Speak more nonsense. Diversions rule the day. The show must go on and so on. Speaking of shows... We weren't. Yeah, well, never mind. Here's a ticket for the show Carpenter's Mounting. Use it. Is 
if it's I'm just gonna say that cow was part turtle it was a turtle cow it's an admiral turtle cow sorry about your shit bull bud but I think that's a good stopping point right here for this episode of Alice Madness Returns. So if you like the episode, guys, um, please drop a like, drop a comment below. Tell me what you think about the mermaid outfit right here, I would say, of Alice. And I think her foot's twitching there. Look at her foot. It's just twitching. That's her twitchy foot. So, and if you're new to the channel, dudes, and you like what you see, why not drop a subscribe right there. It's just below. Doesn't cost you nothing. It'd be pretty cool. It'd help out the channel a lot. And, you know, I tell you what, guys. Thank you for being here. Thank you for being a part of us. Thank you for everything. And I will catch you guys on the flip side. Peace.